love because I got problems with y'all and my friend is here. Y'all always want to know if this is the one. If you don't know if this is the one, the answer is that they are not the one. People look up, y'all Y'all let the past repeat itself in y'all lives when the past was a lesson. And they'll repeat to come back and see how you learn. Are you going to play your life that you're supposed to have grown and moved past this point in the first place, right? To say to yourself, these feelings that I'm feeling right now, is this nostalgia? Because that's what it be most of the time. Every seven years, you, there's a change and a shift that goes on in the human body. Skin, cells, all of that kind of stuff, right? Your, your life is supposed to change as well. If I haven't spoken to somebody in 15 years, and here they come, 15 years later, I don't know this person no more. <laughs> Me personally, I'm not interested in re-getting to know you. No. I go, I'm going to remember everything from then. Oh, yeah, I remember. Mm -hmm. Yep, I remember. I remember all those character flaws. I remember all that shit. I remember, I remember, I remember. Okay, let me remember that and sit on the nostalgia for a minute. If I give myself the chance, I'm not. If you give yourself the chance to now try to learn this person's how they are coming now, right? What changes have they made? How much have they grown? How much have they not grown? How many things have remained the same? I am not going to ride out on nostalgia. I am now going to pay attention to what is this person's reactivation in my life trying to teach me. I'm still stuck. I haven't moved from that time in my life when my brain could decipher what's good for me and what's comfortable in the moment. Sad to see people years later and there's no growth. It is the lesson is this: I still haven't learned my boundaries. I still haven't learned to trust myself. I still haven't learned to step forward in my life and, and understand that I don't have to save everybody. I shouldn't be out here protecting everybody. I shouldn't be out here doing all and being all for everybody out for everybody else. That comes from that innate desire for those who are supposed to be doing something spiritually to put the help and the energy and all of that into the wrong area you're supposed to be figuring out you you're supposed to be strengthening you you're supposed to be doing all of your shadow work all of your soul work all of those types of things to understand that because I wasn't taken care of properly does not mean that my role is to make sure that everybody that comes to my life, good, bad, or indifferent, I am to be that force for them because nobody was ever that for me. That's not your job. You're missing up the message. That's not the message. The message is not that that person is for you. That person is you're still not, the message is that you're still not taking care of yourself. You're still not giving unto self. You're still not learning your spiritual walk. You're still not practicing your spiritual gifts. You still have no structure. You still have no the proper foundation. You have it, but your puzzle pieces are all over the place. You still have not faced you, your sadness, your loneliness, the way that you came up, the way that you've allowed people to use you because you were not allowed to speak freely of the way that you were treated. You are an adult. You have got to kiss and hug that little you and tell her that it is okay. You did not know no better, but you grown now and you got enough love for her now when nobody else was able to give it to you. So now what am I going to do? I'm going to go to my ancestors because in life they didn't give it to me, but now in death I know that they're going to give me everything that I need just because they know that, 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 that they owe it to me. Come on. So, no, this is not the one. You haven't even met you to know what would be the right one. Now, I need you to go and figure out what would be the right one for me. Now, in my current existence, in my current life, in the way that I'm trying to move, who is going to help me build me? Balance me. Give back into me. Without me having to ask. Without me having.
having to beg, without me having to cry, without me having to pay out, purchase, sponsor, who's coming to offer me the things that can help balance what I got going on? That falls in line with my trajectory. Do I know what my trajectory is? No, because I sip the wine a little bit too much and escape from my reality because I be lonely. When in fact, I keep telling y'all, there is no reason to ever be lonely when you got a gang of spirits in your house because I can't even watch a movie by myself without them coming to tell me the ending while I'm trying to watch it. Excuse you, why are you telling me what's going on in the movies? Ma'ams, ma'ams, I'm trying to watch it. They come straight up, tell me the movie. You know, the, the spirit, the t Miss, I, I, I'm trying to, you, come on, come on. You're not learning the lessons. Lessons repeat until learn. Lessons repeat until learn. You cannot let your carnal desires of the flesh ruin and tear down what your Ori has planned for you. What your Ori has started to work for you for. You can't do that. Carnal? No. I don't tell you things that I don't experience myself. Okay? I've had situations. Let me tell you something. I'll give you stories. 